Hello. Welcome to Self-Made Mind. I'm Jeff. Today we're going to talk about humility, being humble. What does it take? Do we all have it? Are some of us so ungrateful that we we leave our humility aside and just think about all the good things that we have in life instead of where we come from. I'll tell you a little story. And again, I won't get personal unless someone asks, and I'm an open book anyway. So when I got married the first time over 27 years ago, right out of the military, um, I got diagnosed as having bipolar one and PTSD. I had a family. We lived pretty good, I thought. Maybe after five or six years, though, it all went downhill. Because my wife at the time, and again, I won't give her her name. I mean, I'm not going to sit here and put shade on her. It's the past. But what, I can, what I'm getting at is that when she put me out in the street and left me homeless, took everything I had, basically, it's because she couldn't understand me or didn't want to understand me. I was in a bad, dark place. But whatever situation I got myself into at that time, I was, I was grasping to stay alive. But I always, I never ever lost my humility. I never forgot where I came from and where I'm at now. Now I got myself out of that situation and got married the second time currently and I have a second family. What I'm saying basically is that when you find yourself in a dark place or have been in a dark place and you're currently somewhere else now, you've, you've got to find yourself humbled in that situation and I don't think there's enough of us that do that I don't think that there's enough people that look at their past and you don't have to look at it with a magnifying glass I'm not saying that because you've been there you don't have to go look at it in detail again because you're you're done with it but when you look back at it and glance at it and say well this is where I was and this is where I'm at now In other words, you can live under a bridge in a box and still be happy. You know, maybe, I mean, temporarily, of course. But if the, if you're hump, uh, happy at that moment that you have a uh, somewhat of a roof over your head and you're eating and you're alive, that's being humble because you're not looking at other people and what they have. You're looking at your situation saying, I'm still living and I'm doing it the best I can. It's a shame, but I think there's too many people out there that want the material things. They want everything that someone else doesn't have. They want to have it better. Or they want things that uh, other people don't have, but they want extravagance. They want their lifestyle to be completely different than someone below them. And that's not humble. That's not being. That's not having any kind of humility whatsoever. I think there's a lot of us. Every human being has some kind of humility, but they won't allow themselves to look at it. I I know there's there's people that have had darker uh, uh, lives than my myself, and there's people that haven't. But whatever situation you look yourself into, or get yourself into, or someone has got you into that situation, the idea is to be humbled that you're alive and that you're living. You're living that moment at that time with what you have. And not that you're just okay with it, but you're living healthy and saying, I've got from this point and now I'm up to this point. 
and there's only one way to go and that's up I've mentioned that to uh, at, on my some of my other videos we need to open our eyes a little bit more to the reality that we're not going to be like someone else and why would we want to you've got yourself in a dark situation at one point if you're currently that at that point right now too then there's only one way to go but if you're humbled on the situation you are right now whether you're in a, a dark place now or if you're in the in the past in a dark place as long as you're living life the best you know how and you aren't care, caring about what's around you at least when it comes to other people and their success so to speak your success is what you do tomorrow that's what your success is and then you can say well I'm humble because I got I got from that point yesterday to where I'm at now as long as you're not going down then you could be humbled for the rest of your life because you're not taking life for granted you're living life every single day to the best of your ability and you're getting better let me leave you, I'll leave you with a quote uh, for today <clears throat> excuse me love is something you cannot give away entirely it always comes back to you I want to thank again everybody here that is uh, participated uh, I want everyone to uh, stay healthy be good to yourselves uh, make sure that you leave a like a comment if you like subscribe if you like if you like any of this content um, there'll be a, a picture of some of my artwork at the end of this video again uh, stay healthy be good to yourself and I'll see you next time